The ring psychology is always the most difficult for anybody to, to pick up. Because it's not something you can learn by somebody telling you about it. It's something you have to have. It's a knack. It's, a, it's like a, a football player or a, you know, or a hockey player or something like that. Or the position you play, it has to be, and, and not because of, uh, it's just a, something that you have, that you, that you sense. It's a sense. It's a sixth sense that, that know when to uh, work the crowd, as they say, or know when to sell or know when to stop a guy, you know, in the middle of a, of a comeback or, or whatever it is. Right. But anybody who wants to be a wrestler should watch every match that they can. When they're done with the match, don't pack your bag and go home. Get dressed, take a shower, and watch, and watch, and watch, and watch, until you get it. Because people want us, everybody want today, in my opinion, everybody today wants to be the, uh, uh, the big guy. He, want, he wants to do all this. Kids come to me and say, let me get my shit in. What shit? Nobody even knows who you are. They don't know your shit. They right. don't know if you're doing your shit or not. Go out there and have a match, learn to wrestle. Then when you get established, then you come out with your shit. And then people will let you do your shit. <laughs> like Jay Strombo, uh, God rest his soul, when he was at the uh, uh, Hall of Fame induction in, in the New England Hall of Fame before he passed, the year before he passed away, a kid came up to him, a young kid, he said, what do you think me doing jobs would hurt my career? And Chief looked up at him and said, what career? Simply said, you don't have a career yet, kid. Worry about doing jobs after you get established. Right. So... In answer to your question, psychology is what, well, is, is an 80, 80 to 90% 80, 80 to of what this business is about.